beginning of this video I'm going to be teaching you how to boost rocket boost the uh, roofs and other things above anything above your head basically and uh, you, two important things you're going to need and only two is the violin and a breaching charge that's all you need to do this no suitcase needed I will show you really quickly the old or the other way to boost over objects uh, which does require a suitcase uh, we're going to do this on Wilton Creek just because Wilton Creek has all kinds of things you can use uh, for boosting. Uh, muffins, most importantly. And uh, I'll show you some cool spots in here. I'm also going to show you the wall walk trick mixed with the boost, roof boosting, or rocket boosting, whatever you want to call it. So let us go. All right, this is pretty simple. This is the way most people know how to get over things. It's for getting over things that are small, like balconies like this. Anything that's about the same height as Agent 47, I want to put a briefcase close to the object you're trying to go over. Then you want to take your breaching charge and put it about halfway, I don't know, about, about right here as far as distance about two suitcases apart. And then from here, you want to throw breakable objects on top of the uh, suitcase. Uh, using muffins here, just because Littleton Creek has a ton of them, and they are probably the second best object to use, first being bricks, in my opinion. And you want them to land on top of the briefcase, which is why you want the briefcases close to the object you're trying to go over. It makes it easier for the pieces to stay on there. Once you get a good amount on there you're going to switch to the charge go close to the suitcase and you're going to detonate and then walk forward if you do it boom like that um, i'm up on the ledge you can see here i should be able and as you can see I, you can walk right off but you want to be able to detonate and then move forward and you should boost right over the object um, you want to boost right over the object all right, now on to the rocket boost, or the boost through objects above you, we will say. You just need two items, the remote breaching charge. You want to take it out and just drop it in a spot right here, and then immediately switch to the violin, and then also drop that on the same spot and so it breaks. Then you do the same thing similar to you were with the, with the suitcase detonate and then walk onto the pieces of the violin and if you do it right boom you you end up going above i went a little higher than i wanted to but i landed on the roof as you can see and you can go through any thin roofs like um even the porch like i did it for the porch because it's a simple thing and you can see you can walk anywhere up on the roof but now i'm going to show you how to mix this with the fence walk so as you can see, I could walk off the roof and explore the backyard here, but I'm fenced in. I can't really go around the rest of the board um, because there's no openings in the back of the fence. And we want to get to the really cool area, which is just past this. So you want to walk to the edge of any, you know, once you're above and there's a fence below you, drop a save. I like to drop a save here. Uh, just in case I mess this up because uh, fence walking is not easy. It is easy, but it can be a pain sometimes. Like this, drop down. Now you want to, this one's a little hard to do because this stupid tree is in the way, but you want to follow it around. It, it kind of gives you a little bit of room to, uh, so you don't have to fall off so easily. And just want to walk the fence. And now we're going to be able to get to an area we would never be able to get to without combining these two tricks the boost jump with the fence walk and i and the fence walk i don't see anyone talk about i've seen the boost jump and the other boost from the beginning but never the fence walk and the fence walk will get help you get around a lot of explore a lot of other areas that you would normally not be able to you want to take this fence at least in wilton creek all the way to the end here if you 
because there's another visible wall, which is why I'm going all the way to the end and then walk off. And now you can see we're in uh, the, the area that's right beyond the fence, which is pretty cool. You can do a lot of exploring. What? Yeah, you see this visible wall Somebody and is play. right here. You could get stuck if you would have jumped off the fence sooner. So, And oh, over oh, here, please. you can go all the way back here. And this car is, is a valid car, meaning you can shoot it. This truck is here. There's the church back there. And you'll be able to see some of the areas that you can go through and some of the areas you cannot. If you can shoot the ground, um, then that's safe to walk on if you shoot and the bullet goes through. But I like to use an object like this. So if you're holding an object like this and you, and, it, and you can see the circle around it, that means you can walk on that area. So even that area you can. If you hold, have this and you're showing it or you're moving it around and the circle is not there and it's going straight through, then like this, down, then you won't be able to walk on that area. All right, so that's the trick. Now, the rest of the video, I'm just going to show you cool locations to go to or, and try yourself that I have found. That's it. All right, this is a really cool location in Mumbai. The overpass is right above me. And this is the area right where that boat is that you could drop on the targets right to my right. But you'll notice this overpass above me. And I figured if I can go through a roof, maybe I can get up on the overpass. And I actually can. I failed this first attempt. So I'm going to cut it and then show you um, the attempt that is successful. But it's, for all of these jumps I do, it's going to be the same thing that you're seeing here. I'm going to drop the remote charge, the violin, detonate, and then walk on. That's all we're doing. Here's a successful attempt. I'm just going to, like I said, drop the remote charge, drop the violin, and then I like to walk from the side it broke on, like that side here, and then walk towards that those pieces. So I'll detonate, walk towards it, and bam! We are now on the overpass, and you can walk on this whole overpass. This is probably the best find I've, I've found for this trick of any board just because you can go anywhere and this part of the bridge is walk through so careful but it's also good because you can walk off e either side and land on top of buildings go out of bounds like this is probably the best find on any of the boards because you can go the entire length of the board and if you save it it will save it exactly there Another cool spot in Mumbai is right here towards where the train tracks are. Drop it here. Drop the violin here. Same thing. Then I'm gonna do a step back, detonate and walk onto it. And if you see it looks like the game is locking up like it is here, that usually means it's trying to push you through through what you're standing underneath. And usually means it's gonna work. So if, usually when you see this lagging like this, that means you are gonna be teleported up. So it's a good sign to see the lag. And boom, I'm through. You see, it doesn't have to be inside a building, it can be just a little ledge. And from on this side, you can see all this stuff, which is kind of cool. And again, I can do the fence walk trick over here. I can walk off the edge here, I'm pretty sure I'll give it a try. The hitbox, or whatever you want to call it, is pretty, not as skinny as the fence, it's a little wider, see? And now I can simply walk down the fence and go all the way down here if I wanted. And I'll show you one more cool spot that I found in Mumbai. This spot is hard to do, really hard, because you're getting shocked by the train tracks. So you got to do it fast. Drop the breaching charge, drop the violin, then go down. And we're trying to hit this little overpass right above us that's halfway there. It's not even fully finished. Bam! This little nothing uh, that's barely hanging over the tracks, you can get on. And then you can walk all the way back that way. But this is a really cool spot. Um, you can see it's barely anything below the tracks. I can even go on the bridge if I wanted to. If I walk between these little yellow bars, I'll fall through. 
but I can walk this beam all the way back there. You can go pretty far back. I can walk and fence walk all of that fence down there. It's, it's crazy. Mumbai has some really good spots. And one thing I want to see is if I can ride the train. So we're gonna, I'm gonna cut this and we'll see if we can ride the train. I've never tried this. I've never even seen anybody else try this. Let's see if we can ride the train without dying. Probably kill us. It's actually, it's actually, oh wait a minute, this thing is moving, I can't, uh, I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna fall, it's just going too fast, faster than I can run, oh man, that's not good. you can get on the train, that's cool, never be able to keep up with it, but it is kind of cool that you can get on top of the train, oh, I'm stuck up in the air because this is where the train, that's crazy, but I'm, what? Am I gonna be stuck up here the whole time above the entire board? That would be cool. Let me see if I can walk. Oh no, I guess it was just that part of the train. But that's another spot in Mumbai, really cool. All right, Hokkaido, I'm in the building where the director is, the top floor corner where the helicopter is. You can see it out there. I'm gonna to try to boost to the roof. Now, most people boost over the railings on this board. I've yet to see anybody get on the roof. Let's see if we can do it. Bam! Right on the roof, right even through the, the solar panels. So this is pretty cool. You can get on top of the roof of the medical center, which again is another thing I've never seen anybody do. Uh, and walk around up here, I guess. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, this is an example in Bangkok of roof, roof or objects you cannot boost through. It's a multi-level roof or object above you, meaning there's two or more layers to it, you'll get to the first layer and not the second. As you can see, I'm on a, a one layer, but there's still another layer of, of roof above this. I just fell through. Um, but yeah, if it's a ceiling like this where there's two layers, you're not going to be able to boost through it. All right, this is Marrakesh. This is the builder that building that Klaus is in. It's in that one room at the top floor. I'm gonna try to boost the roof here. Bang! This is the, I guess this is the consulate building. This is pretty dang cool. We can go all up here on top of this roof. The helicopter's flying above us. And go around on the roof here. Pretty awesome. But there are a lot of places on top of the roof you can fall through. But you can walk off the sides and go down in those areas. Um, but yeah, this is another one is a good example of a roof that you can go through that it's just a single layer. Can I walk up on this thing? Oh, that's just uh, fall through. Anyway, that's Marrakesh. All right, we'll try this one again real quick. Yeah, so up here, you can see I'll just save it real quick so in case I fall through again which is good to do because if you save it out of bounds or any, any area you go to, it will save when you can reload it from here. But again, just shooting to see what I can walk on, what I cannot. But this will be the last one I show. There's other places that you can do boost through. There's some things on Sapienza and some things, oh, this is great, got stuck here. But go ahead and try it on other places see what we can do. There's a big update coming out on the 26th, so I wanted to make sure to show this trick glitch because who knows if they're going to patch it or not before that date, so I wanted to get something out before then. But it is a cool trick, and like I said, most people know the other trick, which is to stand on the suitcase and go over objects, and not too many people know about this one, how to boost up through things and then not only boost up through things, if there's a fence below, which there usually is, or a wall, that you can drop down to that and wall walk that to other areas of the board. I'm not exploring the other areas because just because it takes a long time and I wouldn't want this video to be much longer than it already is. But this is how to get to those areas and then you, do the, uh, you can do the exploring yourself. <laughs> if you want me to do a video to show all the areas, then I can. 
because there's a ton of stuff I can show. I just wanted to make sure to show how to do it. And then uh, you guys can try it yourself in the cool areas that I found. That's it.